Hello guys, welcome back to Amobi channel. As we all know, when you need to factory reset your iPad, you must enter the screen passcode first. But what if you lose or forget the password? Today's video will introduce three easy ways to factory reset iPad without a password. No matter if you forgot or lost iPad screen passcode, your iPad is unavailable or you got the security lockout message. They will all be of great help to you, so let's just start. Method 1. Erase iPad using Forgot Password. This is a new resetting approach for iPad OS 15.2 or higher when you forget the lock screen passcode or get iPad unavailable security lockout message. But if your iPad OS is above 17, the whole process will take less time. In other words, if your iPad OS is 15 or 16, you need to enter more incorrect screen passwords and wait longer for the erase button to appear. Instead, your iPad needs to be connected to the network and you have signed into Apple ID on your iPad. If your iPad has met these three requirements, let's continue. If not, Please pull back the progress bar to see method 3, it will not require these things. Firstly, let's just enter the wrong password for several times, until your iPad shows forgot password on the screen. Click it and you will be asked to enter your Apple ID and password to sign out, then click erase iPad. Then the erase process will start, wait a moment. after your iPad restart. Everything on your iPad will be removed including your screen passcode. All you have to do is set your iPad as a new device. <music> Method 2. Restore iPad via iTunes. Of course, you can use iTunes to enter recovery mode and do a system restore on your iPad. This way only requires you to have a computer with Windows 10 or higher system or the latest version of Mac, in my case. I use a Mac to show how it works. Okay, firstly install the latest version of iTunes on your computer, then connect it to your computer using a USB cable. Then we need to enter the iPad into recovery mode. My iPad doesn't have a home button so press volume up, volume down and then keep pressing and holding the power button, just keep pressing and holding it. Then your iPad will be detected by iTunes, now click restore iPad. Now you will see a pop-up window appear, click restore and update now, and keep pressing the blue button to confirm. Then iTunes is now downloading the latest version of firmware for the iPad to bring it back to normal. This whole process time may take about 30 minutes, so we need to wait patiently. After it is done, your iPad will restart as a new device, as I said above. If your iPad does not have a network connection, the forgot password method cannot be used, or your iTunes fails to download the firmware. Let's use a professional iOS device unlock tool any lock to factory reset iPad without a screen password or Apple ID. Any lock can unlock all kinds of iOS screen locks, and it can unlock your device in minutes, allowing you to enjoy your device immediately. Besides, if you have open Find My on your iPad, it will be locked by cloud activation lock when factory reset. Any lock can also help you remove this activation lock without password. So, it's really a useful tool for you to solve iOS locked issues. Just download it with the link in the video description. Okay, let me show you how it works. Firstly, connect your iPad to computer with a USB cable. Also, we need to enter iPad into recovery mode in the same way as method 2. After that, click unlock screen passcode on any lock. Press start now to unlock your iPad. Then you will see any lock prepare the match firmware to your iPad, click download, and wait for a few minutes. After the download process has been completed, click unlock now and your iPad screen passcode will be removed in a while. As you can see, it's very easy and quick, you can access your iPad successfully now. 
Okay, that's all the three methods for how to factory reset iPad without a password if you think they are helpful. Please kindly leave your thumbs up and subscribe. See you in the next video.